you don't know how much something means until it's taken away from you. This year away from it, it's just, it's a grind, man. I just kept on thinking like, man, I don't know, could this be over with for me? When the 2020 HBCU Combine was canceled, so was the start of Hunter Register and Calvin Lunkin's NFL careers. The former Southern Jaguars never got the chance to showcase their talent before the 2020 NFL Draft. Not having the combine last year played a big role in me not being on the team right now because I feel like I feel like they hated me, but they they didn't see me in person to to you know see my ability, see me work my drills. Lunkins eagerly awaited last year's combine after the linebacker finished fifth in the SWAC in total tackles. Register did not receive an invite in 2020, but he's getting a second chance this year. Last year, I was I felt like I saw who was invited wide receiver wise, and I felt like I should have been invited, but that's neither here nor there. But the, this year, whenever I got it, I was just really excited and uh, glad for me and my teammates that I did get. Four Jaguars will be in Birmingham April 9th, and now Lunkins and Register have more to play for. With their football lives on pause, both have added to their families and are dads. Balancing work while pursuing their NFL dreams is a challenge. It's still a decision that I'm making, you know, because I feel like I can't just put all my eggs in that situation, knowing that a pandemic could mess it up all, all over again. So I'm back at score one. What, what does this say about, you know, perseverance for HBCU athletes, and especially for you having to have that year away from football and, and still having the invite and being ready to go the second they blow the whistle? I just feel like, you know, it's it's the opportunity of a lifetime. It, it, second chances like this don't come around too often. Covering Southern football for your Go Nation, I'm Jared Joseph.